Hi everybody, welcome. It's Corinne Wood here. If you haven't been to my channel before, I'm glad you found it. Today's abandoned video is going to be an abandoned cabin from the 1800s. I really hope you guys like it. I had some challenges, which you will pick up on when I'm in there. I did follow through. I did go through with the video. I didn't quit. And you'll see the reasons why. Um, I had to order special boots, Kevlar boots, because they said there might be snakes in there. So it's just unbelievable. Um, no one's lived there in years. And you will see I had a very hard time going through it. Um, by the time I got done, I had cobwebs hanging from my hair. And when you go in alone, man, your adrenaline is on high. You're listening for, any, for everything and anything. And it just is a freaky situation. So I hope you like this. Just sit back and enjoy and let me do all the work. And the next time you hear me, you will hear me there. I'll see you later. Please hit like and subscribe if you're into these videos. And I will always look for more to do for you. I'll see you later. Bye. <sighs> Okay, you guys, this is where we're going. Here we go. Okay, this is from the 1800s underneath the shingle siding. This was a log cabin. And I was told to be very, very careful when I went in. They said most of the foundation is gone. And uh, I don't know, here goes, right? So, hopefully, I'm not being too dramatic. I don't know how light it's going to be. We'll see here. Oh, boy. Oh, it's not light enough to do. So, hmm. This looks a little scary. I'm just saying got plastic hanging from the ceiling oh no and I hear stuff running around so I'm not gonna go in I'm gonna leave right oh my gosh okay it's on the plastic up here I might oh it's a kitty cat. It's a cat, hello. What are you doing? No, I'm scared, you guys. I don't know what's in here. Okay. Heart attack aside, I hear kittens crying. Oh man, I'm just not sure I wanna be able to get out. Okay, so as you can see, there's this big piece of plastic, and I don't know why it's there. I don't. You can see there's all kinds of stuff in here. Uh-oh. And there's big noises going on in here. Hi, baby. What's in here, kitty? I'm serious. Big stuff is in here, and I don't know what it is. I hear little kittens. I'm scared, you guys. I don't know. Okay. Oh, I wish I wasn't alone. Okay. So, can you hear stuff banging in here? Oh, look at that. Some cool Crocs. But I literally hear stuff like moving. Wow, hear that? Okay, sounds very big. Whatever is in here. Oh, so I'm not thinking this is a cool situation. It's so, oh, hi kitty. How could a cat be living in here? Okay, I'm sorry I'm going so slow, but I'm scared. Can you hear all that? I'm here alone. Literally here alone. Kitty, kitty. Okay. So, I don't know the layout of this place. There's a toilet. Um... 
I don't know how to navigate my way through. Gosh, it sounds like something really big is in the back. Sounds like I'm upsetting it, whatever it is. Okay, so here's this. I'll show you this room right here. And it's rotted through. You can see the roof is rotted. Oh my gosh, something is in here with me. I'm so freaked out. <sighs> okay, so here you go. You can see the logs on the inside. And there was a girl and her brother and sister who lived here. They were here a lot of years and they grew up here. Oh my goodness, stuff is in this place and I don't know what it is. It looks like there used to be an old stove right there. And, oh man, can you hear that? All right, so I'm not sure what to do here. Um, I can't see and I don't know where the steps are. Ooh. And I don't know what that was. So see, something's in here with me. All right, so I can't see around this corner. Um, let's see. I'm just afraid once I get in here, I won't be able to get out without being half killed. All right, here's the plastic from the other side. As you can see, Tobacco sticks, old chairs, cages, toilets, um, pots, cords. Hi, kitty. A really nice kitty that doesn't seem to be afraid. I need to be like a cat, huh? Okay. So there's bees. I don't know how to get by here, so I'm going to pull this. Thanks, kitty. There's okay, here we go. I might be right back. I don't know. Okay, so. All right, doesn't look so bad here. The windows are out. Um, used to be a sink. A little funny. 800. There's an old road sign. Furniture. Bunches of pails. And, oh, I love that blue door. <laughs> I'd love to have that. A little thing up there. It says Mother's Oats. Um, that's about it. I can't get through this way, but as you can see, uh, caught up on stuff. Here is more of the lathe, they called it, wood cabin. And somebody could fix this up, but it would be something. Okay, so obviously if it's way open like this, there's no windows, whatever, you know that anything could be in here, crawling around here. Um, this cat is really friendly. <laughs> I'm trying to get over this stuff. And I don't know. I can't, can't see what to do here. Because I don't understand this building at all. Like the layout. Okay, I'm sorry if you're in the dark. I, shoot. Okay, so stuff is crawling upstairs. I'm sorry. I'm not going to be able to finish this because I don't want to go in alone. I'm by myself. Call me crazy, but whatever. So this kind of just shows you it just isn't, it's not light enough in here. It's not cool. I just don't know what to think about it. And I can hear stuff upstairs. That's what scares me. And I can't, don't know what to touch. Okay. I'm trying to get my nerve up. It just isn't working real well right, right now. Oops, sorry, kitty. And the kitty is trying to stop me at every angle. Here's an old door. There's an old dresser in here. I don't know. It just doesn't look real safe. I don't hear anything. I just don't know the layout well enough. I mean, I hear stuff upstairs. Look at the old little mirror there. I should have brought a flashlight. I just don't feel cool about it, you guys. So I don't know. If I had somebody else with me, I'd have more nerve. I'm just saying that I shouldn't 
be doing this alone. Here's a toilet. I know you can't see it. I gotta get around it. So, I tried, but I don't want to go alone. I'm sorry. But just due to the fact that <laughs> I don't know what, what's up there and what will happen. So, um, I don't know. I'm hesitant, as you can say. And it's like 96 degrees. It's hot. And I hear something upstairs, man. I'm telling you. And I don't know what to expect. Can you hear that? Something with weight is up there. So it could be a coon. It can be anything. I'm just not in the mood to go alone. So... Maybe in the winter. How about if I see if I can do this in the winter? Um, and I will get back to you. I don't want to hurt this kid. Okay, let me see. I got light. Ugh. Stuff falling. Let's see. Let's try this. Oh, my. Okay, I want to see. Here we go. See, I just couldn't see where my feet were. I couldn't see what was around me. That appears to be... Um, what is that? Let me open it. That is an old stove. Okay. All right, so. Here we go. You can see it's just a crazy hot mess in here. So here we go. I don't know what to expect. We're going to try it since I can got some light on the subject. Oh. <sighs> So here goes. Somebody said there was a basement. I don't know how the heck you'd find it in this. Okay. Okay, I hear stuff. Oh, this looks like a bedroom or something. Just a second, let me show you. I'm sorry, but I'm crawling over things. Okay, so. Here's a bedroom. Um, looks like somebody must have tried to fix it up at one point. If you can see. Um, I don't know what's going on. Okay. All right, look at that old piggy bank there. Old door, old latch. Okay. Bees. It's so hot, you guys. So hot. All right, so there you go. This cat really likes me. Now, I'm going to try to go up these stairs, but I don't know. So here we go. Hi, kitty, kitty. Okay. Mm. Man, okay, so if I go up, I don't, I have a blind side here. Oh my gosh, I can't get through. I'm caught. Okay. There we go. I don't know how I'd get. All right, you guys, catch all. All right, so old, very old set of stairs with creepy things. All right, so here we go. Heck, what do? I'm trying to. Oh, oh, oh! Something knows I'm coming. I'm trying to warn them that I'm coming. Okay. So I don't know. You ready for this? <laughs> I'm not. All right. These steps are like, I don't know, three inches. And they're very tall. So I got to be very careful. Oh my gosh, you guys. I'm scared. You better really appreciate this video. Okay. Nothing is making noise. All right. So should I stick? I'm going to stick the can. Oh, okay, something is making noise. I'm going to stick the camera up first. How's that? Holy crap. Okay. Yes, I need to pray. Praying hands. Ooh, I hear bees. I hear stuff crawling. Okay. So there's an old fireplace. 
And there's bees and there's stuff. I am scared to death. Okay, so as you can see, there's years. Uh oh. So, so, oh. So I'm in here with something I don't know what. So I'm going to show you. I don't think I'm crawling up in here to be with whatever is at the other side of this mound. But you guys can hear it. Ooh. Hey, you. Okay. So, as you can see, there's all kinds of things that are stored in here. There's bees. It's hot. I would say it is over 100 degrees up here. But the cat even knows to stay downstairs. Whatever this cat is doing here. So... Should I go up a little more? All right, you guys. As you can see, the old lathe from the it being a log cabin. The, the people that I do know about, that I knew personally, that lived here when they were very young, um, they had to move from this place. And once they moved, they kind of went out of, into the city and some tragedy happened to one of the family members. Okay, it stinks up here. It's, oh my gosh, something is on the other side crawling around. Oh boy, look it, can you see him? Hey there, what are you doing? What are, oh, 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 okay. Hopefully, whatever that is, oh, it's looking at me. You see it looking at me? What you doing? What are you doing? Huh? What are you up to? I don't know what it is. Do you guys know what it is? Here we go. Holy cow, Gertrude. What am I doing up here? All right. So, there's friends up here. Oh, oh, oh. And he's, he's getting all excited. Hi. Okay. It appears to be a buzzard. A, hmm. A a turkey buzzard that I think might fly out of here. It must be roosting up here. A vulture. He sounds mad. Okay, so you got to see that. Anyway, as you can see, I can't crawl around up here. It's totally unsafe. It's totally a place that has all kinds of, oh my gosh, has animals in it. <laughs> it's something to see, right? Okay, you guys. So I'm going to see just a minute, I'm leaving. All right, so I don't see anything out of the ordinary. I just see a bunch of weirdness, right? Okay, so um, that must have been a door maybe that used to be over the top of this. Okay, so I'm gonna get down here. And thanks you guys for <laughs> being kind of here with me. I'm sorry that we couldn't go through this together, um, right? You got spared. I hope you liked it. This is really cool, man. It's kind of weird. So, I'm going to see. Look down here. I'm going to see. Somebody said something about something. I'm trying to see in here. As you can see, it's almost impossible to get through here. It's tons of stuff. But look at the old carpeting. Isn't that neat? You can tell it's really vintage. Oh, and look at that. Man, that is... Ooh, I hear something. Okay, there's stuff here. There's all kinds of things in here. Things. I'm gonna peek. Oh, I love the look of that little thing. Nice little thing. Cool. Okay. So, old furniture. It's got the button tabs on it. Um... Should I open this drawer? Here, there's that. There's just old nails, mouse traps, paintbrush. Okay, you guys, so. Oh, I gotta try to crawl out of this place. Um, <laughs> oh, I love the carpeting. But okay, so that's the best, about the best I can show you. Um. As you can see, a lot of years have gone by. Look at that old box. I like that old box. That's really cool. Don't know what's in it, but it looks cool. And the floor is caving in, so I can't really step in it. I'm afraid I'd go through the old door. Um, yeah. So, 
I think this is about it, you guys. I'm going to crawl through. And as always, I want to thank you for joining me at this abandoned house. Wow. Um, I hope you got to see something neat in it. And I'm trying to get through without getting caught up on stuff. And what something that's hard on me is I wore snake boots because they said that you probably... So, I just wanted to be safe. Better to be safe than sorry. Look at that. Isn't that neat? That old box with nails that tongue and groove. Old leather top. Okay, so we came. We saw a toilet. And, wow. It's quite something to see. Look at the kitty, my friend. All right, so thank you for coming with me. I hope you guys come back. And I'm sorry for sounding so scared, but I didn't know what was upstairs. So we're going to lead ourselves right back out the way we came in and try to be careful. And, oh my gosh, you just wouldn't believe it in here. Look at that old pot. I think there's little gems just here and there. Uh, but, Wow. What an experience. So, again, this is Corinne Wood. Thank you so much for coming along on this abandoned um, log cabin. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you got to see a little bit of history. And when I find out some more, I'll fill you in a little bit better, okay? So you guys take care. And I hope you have a wonderful day, whatever's left. And I will talk to you guys later. Thank you so much for coming, and I can't wait to show you my next abandoned video. Look at, take care, you guys. Enjoy yourself. Bye.